Hey everyone, I'm the Tom. Welcome to my gaming channel. And this time, I'm playing another episode of The Binding of Isaac Rebirth. Um, let's see. Isaac's got a cathedral kill, but no show kill. Maggie, Cain, Judas, e Eve. I think we've. We haven't done anything as Lazarus yet. Let's try that. Cellar one. Those guys are actually really annoying for, you know, level uh, for for floor one enemies. And I don't want to fight the boss right away because it could be the haunt, and I actually want to have a chance of getting to the item room first. Pop's brain. You know. It's not it's not the greatest item, but it can really help out if you if you're actually able to use it from afar. It does a decent amount of damage. It's pretty much a rechargeable uh, Bob's rotten head, which is you know not the greatest item in itself, but having it without 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 a charge time is better, I guess. Oh, without. Uh, having to charge it every three rooms that is obviously once you use Bob's brain it does have a certain kind of cooldown here we go that did some decent damage to the widow at least but the widow is relatively low HP here we go I kill the spider, and it's, it's sin foil. That's really good. Got a damage upgrade and pop spray from the from the first floor. So let's move along. Still don't know what the pill is. Paralysis. Well, whatever. I really don't want pop spray to activate. Oh, there was a spider right behind me. Oh my goodness, I took so much damage there. I just couldn't see that spider. Shouldn't have ta mm, taken this right off the bat. Oh, that's really good. Now I create slowing creep and I look like little Gish. Or Gish in general. That's super nice. Really, dude, those guys have like the best accuracy in the game. I seem to get hit at least once in each room where these guys show up, and, and that's actually ridiculous. Come on. Thank you. Just pin. Nice. Oh, and I did get a deal with the devil, which is kind of surprising. The pack absolutely gonna take that. Can't make me not take the pact. Anyway, let's go down to Caves 1. No, it's not worth my, my last remaining key. Got another one though. Funny. Just wanna give me a golden chest each room. Alright, another key though. So I might actually go to the challenge room though. I really don't want to fire Rob's brain right now. Man, this is actually a dangerous room. Just taking it slowly here.
Okay. We're safe. Yum heart. I'm gonna pick it up just just because I'm not sure whether I've had it before or not. What? That didn't hit. That Bob's brain shot didn't hit. Actually surprised about that. Oh yeah. room is done so I think I'm just gonna go to the challenge room right away actually no I'm gonna I'm gonna go for the for the boss fight and here we have the boss room lucky that didn't hit me mega fatty Shouldn't be the most difficult enemy to use Bob's brain against. Oh man, come on. I'm doing a decent amount of damage though. Thanks to the back and the back and blood clot, as well as Bob's brain. So he can't be poisoned apparently. Didn't get a deal with the devil, that's fine. Six minutes, I can... No, I'm not gonna go to the challenge room because I'm too lazy and I wanna get a chance of... Uh... Oh, really, Curse of the Maze is so annoying. Anyway, I wanna get a chance of doing the boss rush room, boss rush mode with Lazarus, because just to get that out of the way. Come on. Thank you, Bob's brain. Don't need that red heart. Um, let's see, let's go up it this time and we get some spiders and some wall crawlers. Man, that was close. Not gonna go to the curse room because I don't want to hemorrhage my my soul heart. Because ah, uh, really, dude. I want to give myself the best possible chance of getting in a deal with the devil. Really, that shot hit me. I'm, I'm actually gonna take red hot damage on this floor. It's probably the catacombs too, isn't it? Yeah, very, pretty definitely it is. Let me check after this room. Yeah, it is. No tinted rocks so far. But then we don't have that many bombs, so it's not a huge deal. Come on. Yes. Chemical peel is not the most amazing item, but it's gonna make our blood clot shots even stronger. Blood clot, uh, blood clot shots, it's, al it's also the name of... Uh, I don't know. Forget forget what I just said. Um anyway. We're gonna Oh it's it's the name of uh, my 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 mate's favorite alcoholic drinks, blood clot shots. Yeah. I took retro damage there, so I'm not gonna get a devil room after this fight. 
anyway, I'm hoping I can survive here and not hit myself with Bob's brain. There we go. Cannon 9 Taurus is at least a damage upgrade. What's this? Tears up, thank you. Alright, so let's just go down to the next floor. Depths 1. Nine minutes in. So the, the hands are dead. Come on. Really, dude? What? Yeah, sure. Now Pop's brain shoots. Here we go. I really can't justify going to the curse room. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna take so much damage here. I mean, hopefully I'm not, but knowing myself, I actually think I am. But it's looking fine so far. Yeah, only took one hit. I mean, I shouldn't have taken that, but... Oh! Yeah, don't ever trap yourself in a corner against this guy when there's a gap. And yeah, that's exactly what I just did, so... Do as I say, not, not as I do. The devil could help me out later. I actually don't know about my chances of beating the boss rush mode if I can access it. Oh, when I access it, because let's face it. There's pretty much no way I'm gonna be slow enough to not beat mom within 20 minutes. But am I gonna beat mom is the question. Wait a second. Right, I'm sorry guys. I I had a very important phone call. I'm at Depths 1. I got a choker card. The devil. I'm gonna use the choker on this floor if I don't get a deal with the devil naturally after this boss fight and uh, so here we go and I didn't get one so what I'm gonna do is use the choker right now and uh, Cheers up, thank you. I found pills, whatever. The mark is very nice. Not gonna take fear shit though. Uh, the devil, that's what we wanna roll with. I haven't gone to the item room or the, sh or the shop. I mean, the shop is probably not very, very uh, likely for us because I only have five cents. Anyway. Um, I'm gonna go right this time. That was a really easy room. That could have gone very annoying if those scars actually would have started moving a little bit sooner or faster. Oh man, I hate this room. Just kill one. Bob's brain. Thank you. Thank you, Bob's brain. So this one's dead as well. Come on. Ah, uh, you didn't hit. Ah. Uh, Fuck. <laughs> Here we go. 
Really? There we go. Where's the item room? It's, it could be up here, which it is. Flat penny, so good. Common cold. For a second, I thought, what? Did we, did we just get a second Bob's brain? <laughs> oh man, just imagine that. Just imagine having two Bob's brains. <laughs> that would be absolute chaos. Anyway, we're gonna go down to the next floor. Which is gonna be... Adapt to not not necropolis, and I'm very happy about the, the fact that it's not necropolis. Oh man, not very happy about the way I'm handling this currently, <laughs> which is splitting up <laughs> all the parts before killing one. Oh, Bob's brain hit something. That's always good. If it hits, it does a lot of damage. Man, we just we just ripped ass there. Ah, uh, fuck. Thank you for the golden key. Oh no! Come on, you can do it. Oh, man, really? I thought I wasn't in the explosion radius. That went pretty smoothly. Oh no, I hate this room. <laughs> there we go. That was kind of dangerous, but it worked out. Oh no, don't trap yourself there. But I'm an Azurus, so I come back to life. Oh, I hate this room. I mean, all of them have very easy patterns, but there's just there's just so much shit going on. Ace of spades, pretty good trinket. Rubber cement. Very funny item, at least. Not the greatest item, but it but it will make for some sweet synergies. Does Bob's brain bounce off the wall now? No, it doesn't. Man. <laughs> it's Red Mom. Here we go. Bob's brain is on cooldown now. Just don't get hit by the foot. Can get hit by, by the bullets though. Can afford to get hit though. That's what I meant. There's a paper clip. Oh, the safety pin. That. Oh, wait. There's a tinted rock here. And we have a golden key, so. Well, that is effectively useless. Um. What do we take? I think we're gonna go with Mini Mush. Because Cursed Eye is not very good. Oh, really? And the other thing... That was... Uh, the small following fam familiar that... Uh, that spawns uh, slowing creep behind it. Uh, that was not worth picking up because we already have that ourselves. We don't need a familiar to do that for us. We're doing a lot of damage though.
Oh man, we took damage. I'm still in a scary position HP-wise. However, if I could just uh, manage to navigate around those uh, hearts, if I do get hit repeatedly, um, then I should be fine. I shouldn't actually be in risk of death here. But I need to... What the hell? I didn't take damage there. I actually need to uh, do as I say, which is uh, if I get hit, if I get down to half a red heart, I need to maneuver quickly and and be able to take those red hearts that are lying around. Gurdy just melted. Oh man. That was bad. Gish, can you actually damage a uh, monster too? Oh, I thought Gish was the one who died there. Just don't take full hearts of damage. For example, by one of those pin bombs. Nothing here can do a full heart of damage. But, but, yeah. Take another one. And take another one. That, I, I didn't do that on purpose. Just if, just in case you were wondering. Just don't walk on the creep. It does full heart of damage. Oh yeah. So the mask's still alive? Shouldn't be that much of a problem, though. Here we go. There's Famine. If he hits me with the charge attack, that's also a full heart of damage. I think we're fine. For now. But everything on the room will kill me. Oh. The sides. The sides do a full heart of damage now? Oh. Well. We tried. Whatever. So, if you enjoyed this episode, please click the like button. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.